Well, to some people out there that may have me highly confused, I am not interested in being anything more than just friends with guys at this point in time in my life, okay? I'm not looking for a boyfriend. I'm not looking for a husband. I, look, I've been there, done that, boring, next. You know, that's my attitude, you know what I mean? I enjoy being single. I enjoy being on my own and not having to deal with insecure men out there. Uh, the clingy types, the controlling types, uh, the jealous types. I'm just happy being on my own now i don't mind having male and female friends but as far as i'm concerned being in a relationship right now is not for me and i'm happy being single and i honestly feel that you don't need a man to make you happy and men out there you don't need a woman to make you happy either you're just going to be strong and um literally you know learn to understand that you can only be your true best friend and that you've got to love yourself first before you can love anybody else. Look, I understand there are a lot of lonely men and women out there who are desperate to have, you know, love. And, and they're lonely and they've got to have someone by their side. And look, honestly, look at the world around you. The world's getting worse by the minute. So just enjoy being with yourself, you know. Yeah, go out and have fun and socialize and get to know new people and all that. But... Honestly, like, oh, the idiots out there that I attract, it is unbelievable. It's so off-putting. It makes you just go, ugh, you know what I mean? <laughs> like, well, it's the honest truth, you know? Like, I just got a message from some dude. Doesn't seem to get the concept. It's like, I don't bloody know you from a bar of soap. I'm not going to run to a different country to go and meet someone I don't hardly know. I'm a strong believer in getting to know people slowly. Um, and, you know, form a bond. And, you know, if we don't get on, we don't get on. Don't have to be, you know, best of buddies, just be acquaintances. There's nothing wrong with that either. But the thing is, I'm not the type of person that's easy and sleazy and that will just, you know, you know, show nude pics to people I don't hardly know on social media. I'm not like that. I'll never will be like that. And... I don't care if you're Brad Pitt. I don't care if you're a rich person. You're not going to get your way when it comes to me because I'm the boss. And I say what I say goes um, as far as I see it. And, uh, yeah, when I say I'm not interested in being with anyone, uh, that's what I bloody mean. I'm not pussfooting around. I'm not mucking around here. I'm being brutally upfront and honest here with everyone out there, with every man out there that wants to message me and follow me and hoping that they're going to get a sex chat or whatever out of me. The answer is no, it's never going to happen. Dream on. Just understand that, you know, you've got to be realistic about things and look at the bigger picture. So you've got to be careful in the way you approach me and what you say to me because you can throw me off kilt and I'll just lose interest in you and listen. 0 0.5 seconds. And I'll put you on hold. Let me put it to you, you know, let me put it to you that way. So understand it when I say that I strictly only want to be friends with people on social media. That's what I mean, which means we're never going to meet face to face. Just strictly, slowly get to know each other through socials. Okay. And yeah, and I'm only interested in getting to know people that live in Australia, that live in Victoria that don't live overseas and, you know, I don't want to, you know, travel, you know, half the world across just to meet a friend. You know what I mean? Like, rather get to know people that live not too far from me where it's easy to catch up with them from time to time when I'm able to. And, um, as of course, me being a full-time carer, it is awkward at times. But um, whenever I'm able to is when I'm able to. So, yeah. I hope I've got it loud and clear. If I get any more kinky, weird men coming my way, dropping weird messages, you're going to be in for a rude awakening because I'm going to tell you straight, loud and clear. Okay? All right? Now, if you're a very, very lonely person, you've got to look more close to home. You know, there's got to be women out there in your country, wherever you live. You know what I mean? <sighs> if not, oh, gee, I, I don't know. Just learn to enjoy being single for a while. There's no harm in that. You're not going to die if you don't have a woman in your bed every night. Come on. <laughs> Take a chill pill. You'll be fine. Your, your penis and balls aren't going to drop off. You'll be all right.